Hi, good evening. This is Scott at Scott Trades on Twitter with StockMarketMentor.com and your chart of the day. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't know too many people that get really excited about coal, except maybe bad kids around Christmas. But coal stocks are working great in this market. We have a couple uh, coal stocks we're trading over at StockMarketMentor.com, and I wanted to share this setup with you today from Arch Resources, ticker ARCH. So as you can see, if I zoom out here a bit, Arch is in a well-defined uptrend and above all the major moving averages. Now compare that to the SPY, which is in a major downtrend, at least for now, and below all the major moving averages. And so Arch is working great in this market and in my opinion is a stock that you should definitely keep an eye on because if the market does turn around, this is near its highs. And so if this follows the market higher, you know, there's not nearly as much resistance near the highs. So the setup here on Arch is that it's in a nice short base of consolidation, been going sideways for about a month or so. And we have some clearly defined levels of resistance. Look right here, hit resistance, bounce back, bounce back, bounce back, bounce back, got above but couldn't hold above. And then here we are again. We're just kind of at that 176 zone on ARCH. It looks better on a short-term chart. Hit that level, flushed. And then the buyers, look at the volume here on the short-term chart. Buyers came in, brought it back up, but it went up a little too fast. And now we're just kind of chugging higher with this 30-minute uptrend on ARCH. And so I don't know when this stock is going to go or if it's going to go at all, but I definitely think that 176 level is something to watch. And so I'm going to set an alert just below 176 for the next, eh, let's go month. And I'm going to look for a strong move above that level and a close coming on higher than average volume. Now that will probably give me at least some sense that the stock is moving out of consolidation. Now, if it does break above that level, ideally you'd want to take that trade and put a stop right under either the eight day or the 21 day exponential period moving average. A close below those two lines and you know what? Maybe the stock's not ready to go just yet, but I'll be watching it for a move through 176 coming on higher than average volume. If you want to find out what other coal stocks we're taking a look at, take a trial over at stockmarketmentor.com. Hopefully, I'll see you on the other side.